Hi guys, this is Steve A. This is Tarantula Tastic Enclosures, and this is my first attempt at a pokey commune. Hi guys, welcome back. Right, today we are doing a Pokey Commune. Right, uh, first I've got to say a big thank you to Dave Wurzel. Um, I sent my mail there uh, quite a while ago now and this is the result of the pairing. So we got like seven of these little beauties coming back and I said I just wanted enough just for a little commune to try out because I've never actually done it myself. If we're actually going to have to split them up when they're older, then so be it. But um, we will we'll have a bit of fun along the way. Um, I'll be posting updates and bigger enclosures that they go into um, in the future. So please do stay tuned on that. So without further ado, we are going to get down to the unboxing and we're going to rehouse these little demons. Seven day binks. So we're going to try and do this really slowly. That's one, two. Two in. Seven little cuties all to go in. Now we're probably going to have to split these up when they get older, but we're going to have a little bit of fun growing them up all together. So what we've done, we've done a simple little setup. We only want one hide in here, so we want to basically try and keep them all together in the same part. And I think the secret with doing these is trying to keep them in the tightest space as possible. So they don't, they just learn to live in the same sort of area. So they don't, don't become territorial. As I say, we're probably going to have to split these up when they're adults. Or sub-adults. But for the time mm -hmm. being, let's give it a go. So let's just see how many we can get in. One, two, whoa! That was a quick one, two. Three, four, five, <laughs> six, last one, number seven. Let's have a little look in here. What we're going to do is just shut it up and let them chill out. I've got one nice big hive that they all can go under. Awesome. And that was a quick, easy rehouse. So that was a little bit easier than I actually thought. Um, I actually put them all into the one tub and then just um, transferred them into that little tiny enclosure. 
So what we're probably going to do is leave them um, until they molt a couple of times and then I've got another enclosure earmarked for the next um, communal journey on those ones. I know um, a lot of people say these don't work and stuff and you probably yeah, have to uh, eventually split them up in the future. But so be it, we'll have a little bit of fun along the way, um, see them grow. I'm trying my best uh, just to... Uh, We'll keep the enclosure nice and small, feed them, feed them loads and loads and loads, um, and we'll see how it goes. I've seen um, quite a few bigger um, enclosures with loads and loads in it, a GV sort of bigger, bigger age. So if we even get to that stage that we've got to split them up, then so be it. But we're going to have a, a little tub of fun on feeding days and et cetera, et cetera. Big thanks to Dave Wurzel for all his um, work on breeding these two. They are particularly hard to breed, so thank you very much, mate. He's a good mate of mine. Um, he is an absolute diamond. Um, I spent the day on a tarantula room stand with him um, last year, and we had such a giggle. He is a top bloke. Top bloke. Um, I cannot wait to see him again at one of the shows and we'll have another, another massive giggle together as well. He's a top geezer. Right, apart from that, guys, um, we've got the American Werewolf um, build coming up soon, so please stay tuned for that. We're in filming um, stage at the minute, but as you know, a lot of these enclosures do take a very long time to film. So... Uh, I think I've got another couple of videos in between trying to keep uh, the content going while these builds uh, are going on. I've um, sort of, this one's gonna, it's got loads of different bits to it which all take a lot of time, like drying times and everything else. So please bear with me, there will be a big enclosure um, video coming very, very shortly. Apart from that, guys, thank you so much for watching. As usual, hit that um, comments down below. Give us a comment on the video. Tell me what you think. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Do, 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 do. Notifies you of upcoming videos. Doesn't cost you a penny, but it does mean a lot to me. Apart from that, guys, I shall see you later.